This is WPTV News Channel 5 at 5.30. A local doctor has passed away from COVID. Tonight, friends and colleagues remember him and the impact he had on South Florida. Condolences pouring in tonight from all across the state after friends and colleagues say COVID-19 is believed to have claimed the life of a beloved South Florida physician. WPTV News Channel 5's Lenny Sapal shares the legacy of Dr. Roman Peña. It, it really, it really hits home. South Florida's medical community grieving the loss of Dr. Roman Pena, a pediatric intensive care physician who spent decades caring for children in need of critical care. Of course, for us, quite significant hours because our, our little boy was dying. Scott Bunkelman met Dr. Pena 18 years ago amidst the heartbreaking journey as his five-year-old son, Seth, battled cancer. And Dr. Pena was just very good with us and got us through those very torturous days and hours. We knew he was trying and he helped us get to that when we were ready. Standing by the Bunkelmans during their most trying times. He was there when our son Seth passed. It was late on a Friday night and he stayed. I think our son passed about one in the morning. Dr. Pena probably stayed there till at least two with us. Even years later, Dr. Pena's memories of Seth still vivid. And he looked at me. We both looked at each other for a second. And then he, he pointed at me and said, train man. Train man was our son's nickname. The fact that he remembered train man really, really took me commitment to children that went well beyond the medicine. The way he handled us, the way he handled our situation, the way he handled our son, it's, it's just such a rare quality. Every life is precious. To lose any life is precious. But what Dr. Pena did to lose him is, is such a tragedy. In Palm Beach County, Lenny Sue Paul, WPTV News Channel 5.